Yo guys, what's up? Scammer of all chan. Today I'm bringing you guys a tutorial on how to disable slash turn off uh, Windows 10 updates. So I know it can be pretty annoying. A lot of people, uh, you disable a bunch of stuff in Windows, you pretty much make it how you want, and then Windows updates, and they like to change all your settings back so they can basically get all the information still, and it's just, it's really annoying. Um, and it, it it just sucks. It's it's almost worse than Cortana. I also have a video how to disable Cortana, which I will put in the card up in the corner. Um, but yeah, so it's actually very simple to disable this. You don't really need to know much, but you probably will need to be the owner of the computer, so you will have to have administrative privileges. Um, if it's your computer, you're fine. Uh, but yeah, so just gonna go to the start button, and you're gonna search computer management now mine already came up so I'm just gonna click it here but you search computer space management and it's gonna come up computer management it's a little you know uh, computer screen with a toolbox so you're gonna open that it's gonna open all the all these menus here and you're gonna go all the way down to the bottom you're gonna click service and applications and then you, right here you see services you're gonna double click that there you go and if you want you can uh, expand this because it's not very uh, big when it's first opened. So yeah, just expand this up here and you're going to want to look for Windows Updates. So we're going to go all the way down to W. Here we have W and we're going to go to Update. There we go. Windows Update right at the bottom. Um, so yeah, you see right here Windows Update. So what you're going to do is you're going to right click that. You're not going to click any of this. You're going to click Properties and then right here you're gonna see um, startup type you're gonna set that to disabled and then it, it should say stop here I'm gonna start mine so you can see now it's running my windows update is running but um, you're gonna want to set this to disabled because this is basically every time the windows the computer turns on instead of um, automatic or something it's not just gonna turn on and be like and you won't have to do this every time so you're gonna put that to disabled and then you're gonna click stop it's gonna bring up this prompt then down here you're gonna click apply so that applies it now Windows update won't work um, we could test that by going to update check for updates system settings bring that over here we're gonna check for Windows updates and then we're gonna see here there was a I mean uh, there were some problems installing updates but we'll try again later if you keep seeing this and want to search the web or contact your support information this may help and it's going to give you this code and this is basically just because we disabled it so if I go here to Windows Update and I go to Properties again um, you can see it's all disabled and if you want to change it back you just do that you're gonna to have to apply everything again but yeah so you can close that you can close everything else I think I still have another one yeah no you could close it all and then if you ever want to get back to it you just you know do those same steps right click uh, turn it on and then there you go so yeah that's uh, how to disable Windows updates uh, very short video if you guys want to uh, check out my Instagram it's scammer vaults I've started posting a little bit more on there and also I've started putting these tutorial videos onto my website scammervaults.com I have a lot of tutorials on there I have full tutorials on how to set up a virtual machine without the video so if you guys just really interpret that a lot better through reading you can find that on my website. I'll put that link in the description. But other than that, I hope you guys enjoy this video, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.